Hey guys and welcome to the channel once again. As you all know, this is Afri's concept. What will bring you the um, the news um, and the latest things trending around the world, um, globally and nationally, internationally. This is where you get it. Um, you're gonna have an amazing experience. Trust me. So if you've not subscribed, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the not notification. Um, the bell so you can get notified whenever we drop um, and, up and upload our broadcast all right all right so today we're going to be looking at um, the indigenous people of Biafra threatens Kubana chief priest and also accuses governor Uzodima of sharing phones to emo youth to spread lies all right this is a situation that has been ongoing for the past 24 48 hours and um uh this is such a situation that has been um for weeks now so the indigenous people of biafra the high pob has accused governor hope who's the demon of the emo state of distributing smartphones to youth in the states to dent the image of those agitating for the freedom of the southeast this is such a situation that we have here um, concerning the Biafra nation, um, agitating for their freedom, you know, they want to get free, they want to be on their own, do their own thing, and you know, live their life and for the betterment of their people because of the corrupt, the corrupted system of the Nigerian government and the um, um, the terrible deformation this has caused. So they desire so well that they want to be um, independent on their own. And I believe we're all familiar with this story so long. So, um, um, but the situation here has it that um, the people part of the southeast, um, even the Imo state governor and uh, the Kobana priest, has shared phones for youth, smartphones to use in the state to dance the image of those agitating for the freedom of for the southeast. Now, this was contained in a statement issued on Tuesday by the group's media and publicity secretary, Ima Powerful. Ima Powerful is the um, the PRO, the group's media, the one in charge of the media and information section of the IPOB. And he um, made this statement known to the general public um, on concerning the issue of um, this Imo state governor and the priest on trying to dent the image of the um, Biafra nation. He noted that Uzodima is an enemy of the state, stressing that if he had good intentions for Imo youth, he could have created better opportunities for them. So what he's trying to say here is that uh, if Uzodima, um, which is the Imo state governor, and um, the priest, the Kubana priest, has good intention for Imo youth, instead of um, denting or ruining the image of those agitating for the development and the um, independence of the Biafra nation. They should at least get them job opportunities, create better job opportunities for them, get them jobs, get them fixed, and make their life better. Um, the group also won Nigerian socialite Pascal Chibuke Okechuku, probably known, uh, popularly known as the Kubana chief priest, against interfering with the affairs of the state. Um, this is trying to pass the message that the fact that you're wealthy and influential, um, they're trying to say it's not all matters that your influence can get you through. Um, some of these things you have to um, apply wisdom, understanding, um, to be able to get through some matters. The group also uh, has warned um, the Kubana chief priest. And in, in, in the one in the statement reads that the attention of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB under the command of a indefatigable liberator, Mazi Namdi Okuchuku Kanu, has been drawn to the sharing of smartphones by the Supreme Court Administrator of Imo State. Opus Odima to the gullible minds of the youth he is recruited to attack IPOB members on social media platforms. This attack dogs and e rats are paid to propagate a lies and smear campaign against the IPOB. Eastern Security Network and Biafra agitators. We blame those who is deceiving with smartphones, material things, and cash to oppose those fighting for their freedom. So they want, as you can see, the aim of the Biafra 
our movement is actually to secure freedom for their people. And in doing this, the um, have to face a lot of rigor, face a lot of things. And in one of such things now is the governor of Imo states going against them, trying to uh, tarnish their image by partnering even with um, the Kubana chief priest on getting youth um, smartphones to tarnish the image of such uh, men. And so it is further written here that um, if Opu Zuduma has current attention for the Imo State Youth, he wouldn't have given them phones to um, attack IPOB. It would have provided industry and companies where the youth will work and produce phones for sale. Imo youth should know that Uzodima is taking them for granted. They should stop being gullible. We are warning Mazi, Pasca, Chibuke, Okechuku, popularly known as Kubana chief priest to steer clear and not strike a deadly deal with Ope Uzodima. You should not dare IPOB. Because the indigenous people of Biafra, I tell you, it's, it's such a force. They are such a force of people together. And so he said, let him continue his restaurant business and not get deceived by Ope Uzodima and his APC co travelers. Anyone who knows this man should tell him to retrace his step and don't allow Uzodima to use him to fight innocent people. So here we have it um, in today's news. I serve out to you on the table. Um, this is the situation of the Imo state and its youth where the governor is sharing out smartphones. The basics of these smartphones is actually to um, tarnish the image of Many of these Biafra um, agitators, Biafra pioneers, Biafra movement pushers, so that they can stop the um, movement and begin to um, bring, bring about a degrading to the Biafra uh, movement. And we all know that these people are fighting for their freedom. They're fighting ferociously. They're not ready to give up. They're ready to give you what it takes. Uh, they're ready to pay the sacrifice just to see that there is a betterment, and they are trying to get rid of the um, this um, corrupted government that is not benefiting them. All right, so my dear viewers, that's all we have for today. Um, let me know what your opinion is in the comment section, and let me know what you feel about it. What do you feel about it? About the youth supporting? Or the youth against the um, IPOB and its leader, Mazi Namdekanu. All right, thank you for streaming with us today. Um, see you next time.